Absolutely. So what does it take for someone to make you fall in love with them as an artist? Like at the end of the day, there has to be a bit of love that you have to be like this guy or this girl, this person is so, I can see the diamond in the rough. Is it an yeah. energy thing for you? For you to want to ride yeah. so hard for them, you know? For me, you know, in order for myself to fall in love with an artist, you know, it starts first and foremost with their artistry. And with the artistry, that's anything. That, that can come from the music. That can come from um, their charisma. That can come from their star quality. That can come from their aura. That mm -hmm. could come from, you know, whatever talent it is they have. Obviously, you know, you want you want you want your client, your artist to be talent driven, whereas, you know, obviously they're so talented that that speaks for itself. But it's not just about talent, right? There's all these other variables that live within an artist when an artist walks in the room, you know, and how they're um received in the room, mm -hmm. you know, and the energy that they're giving and receiving, that says something to me. I've seen people walk in the room that uh, aren't artists, but just have like a really dope, great, unique style that everybody's just kind of like drawn to or, or, yeah. or yeah, or a good personality that everybody's drawn towards. So those are the things that I'm looking for first and foremost, because remember, you don't know these people in the beginning and then getting to meet them and getting to, you know, know who they are as a person. For me, it's like, what are your goals? What are your aspirations? Uh, what do you want to do? Do you want to change the world? How do you want to change the world? Mm. Um, do you want to change things in your neighborhood? Do you want to make music for now or do you mm -hmm. want to make music be a legacy artist forever you know what i mean so i kind of look at all those things and then you know when those kind of things check out of course it's it's energy it's uh you said it earlier and i love that you said it you said it's like dating right it's like mm -hmm. i think that the industry is like also it's like courting you know what i mean yeah, and you know you have you, you court somebody you want to date a woman what do you do you court her right you ask to take her out you take her out to some place that you know you want to impress her uh, him or her rather um, you want to make sure that you you know everything's perfect you want to make sure the vibe is right you want to make sure you're courting them same thing when you're trying to sign an artist or sign someone you're courting them yeah. the thing is don't let that shit just be a honeymoon phase you know what yeah. I mean don't don't do that and for the first three months or the first three years of your 10-year journey you know it's just great in the beginning right we've all heard that story mm -hmm. you know the first few months is always the best the first year whatever you know have those that same relationship keep that same energy throughout mm -hmm. and you know i'm just as excited i'm just as ambitious i'm just as driven mm -hmm. i'm just as if not you know, more because it deepens if not more for me right? you're 10 like years later than i am correctly correct 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 so that's my thing you know what i mean but a lot of people just like in relationships after a while, tend to like, you know, lose interest. Look they tend to, the to like, you know, do less and less than what they were before and not treat it like that thing you wanted in the beginning so bad. Mm, beautifully put. Can't lose that. Uh, it's sacred and you got to protect it and you got to fight for it. You got to fight for each other. Yeah. And then that's all matters. And also, I guess to answer your form, the simple answer to that is I can't want this more than you do. I can't want success more than you do. I can't want, you know, I can't want it more than you do. I can want it just as much or equally or, or, you know, more in a sense of just by a little bit. But I mean, like, I can't be on a hundred and you're on 42 as if everything is all good. Cause then it, it just won't work. I'm not, you know, I think you have to be compatible with the person you're working with. 